The kind of people who are drawn to environmental sciences are people who want to spend at least some of their time out here. You know, the idea of going to the same building and the same desk for their entire job is unappealing. It's folks who want there to be a little bit more dynamic, who every so often, or you know, some a little, some a lot, want to get out to nature, want to get out to wilderness and have an adventure. I decided to go into environmental sciences so I know what I'm looking at when I'm outside so I can help the environment, I can restore everything that I'm looking at. Being around Vermilion there's a lot of oil sites and I thought it would be interesting to learn how to restore that back to its natural habitat. These students leave with understanding of different types of ecosystems, what goes into those ecosystems and what the components in those systems really need. So if they're working on a project where there is a disturbance or if they're trying to fix something, they can have this in-depth understanding of what's going wrong and they're not afraid to get out there and measure it or evaluate it or actually dive in and look. We get to hit up all the different ecosystems. So we'll go to a grassland, we'll go to wetlands, we'll go to forests. Any of those labs are great because we connect what we're learning in class directly with what we're seeing in the field. No matter which stream you take, there are numerous opportunities, whether you want to work industry or nonprofit or whether you want further education, you're going to be able to do all of that from this program. Lakeland Enviro students get jobs because they've done it already. They've actually been out here and they've done the stuff that they're going to need to do for their job. That's why they get priority over students who maybe come from other programs who don't get that access, who don't get that ability. I chose to start, study environmental sciences at Lakeland because I really wanted that hands-on aspect. I feel like it gives me a bit of an advantage in applying for jobs because I visited with a few university students who are studying similar environmental science stuff that we are here and they feel like they don't have the hands-on ability to use equipment that employers are looking for. 